Hi everyone, it's Talia and welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video. So for today's video, I'm so excited to be filming this and if you guys can't already tell from the title, I'm going to be showing you guys what YouTubers have picked for me to wear. I've seen this video floating about and I just had to jump onto the trend of it and yeah, I just thought it was so much fun and I feel like I got a good mix of people, like all their fashion senses are very different so I'm super excited to see what they've got for me. So the first person I contacted was obviously my bestie Amber and when she sent this to me she was like this is a typical Amber night outfit and she has not disappointed shall we say. So I'm going to start off with this top. Um, this is literally like I think I see Amber in one of these tops like literally every single day. So it's basically like is it a racer back high neck top? It actually has is that orange or red thread? I think it might be orange. And then we have got some wide leg trousers. So they're like ribbed. They are really soft. They're a very, I don't know what material it is, but it's a very nice material. They've obviously got an elasticated band and yeah, I love a wide leg trouser. I'm happy that they're not flares, but I don't think I've ever seen Amber in flares anyway. So far, so good. Not gonna lie, don't think that the top is really my kind of vibe, but we shall see when it is on. And finally, if any of you guys watch Amber, you will know she is literally like the denim jacket queen. We've got a denim jacket. So this was actually really interesting. It has a zip, but I really like the wash of it. It's like a bleach wash. I don't know if that's even the right way to describe this. You guys know I'm not um, a fashion channel. I just do a little bit of everything over here. <laughs> really happy with this actually. I think I'm gonna get a lot of wear out of this. I got everything as well in the size eight, apart from a couple of things. But I'll tell you guys about those later. Let's go try it on. So guys, this is Amber's outfit on. And if I'm being completely honest, I feel like this is obviously such an Amber outfit, but I personally wouldn't pair them together. I really like the top half. I absolutely love this denim jacket. It's literally the perfect cropped length, fits me perfectly. And I like that it's a little bit different with obviously the zip. I wouldn't do it up, but you guys get the gist. But just for me, I wouldn't really pair the grey wide leg trousers with the jacket. I feel like it matches the top obviously because the top's only white. However, I really do like these wide leg trousers. They are so comfortable. Like I can 100% imagine myself wearing these like every single day. They are quite long, like they do drag on the floor and I'm five foot five and as I said earlier, I think I got them in a size eight. So if you guys are gonna grab these, um, just beware that they are kind of long, but obviously you can definitely alter that. But yeah, I like this outfit. Not sure if I'd pair it together. Definitely an amber outfit though. I absolutely love the denim jacket. I just want to give you guys a little look at it again because it is honestly the cutest thing and you will definitely be seeing me. You see me? You guys will definitely see me wearing this denim jacket. So shout out to Amber for providing me with three new pieces of clothing that I'm probably going to live and die in. Next up I asked Nicole what I should wear and as soon as I was thinking about YouTubers to ask, I knew that I should ask Nicole because I just knew that she was going to put me in something really cute because I love her fashion sense. She's honestly the nicest girl ever as well. She's so sweet and down to earth. So the first thing I picked up were these jeans. I believe that they're actually straight leg jeans. So I don't know how they're going to fit on me because I have quite big thighs. So I don't know if I'm going to get the right vibe. And I've accidentally been sent a size 8. So I don't know if these are even going to fit me, but I do have a pair of mum jeans that if all else fails, we will put those on in a size 10 because they're not very stretchy and I'm a little bit worried that they're not going to fit. But they are really, really nice jeans. So they have a few rips in, they have a frayed hem. For the top, this is actually Nicole's second choice because the top that she originally sent to me was actually sold out. So we had to go for another one, but I actually really, really like this. It's going to be really hard to show you guys, but it's like obviously a cropped top with frilly sleeves and it also does up at the front. This is such a summery top and I'm super excited to see what it looks like on. Guys, I am genuinely obsessed with this top. As I mentioned, um, I couldn't get on the jeans because, so these are a size 10 and they are still baggy on my waist. I actually can't find any of my belts though, which is kind of annoying. Um, but normally I just belt them and they fit absolutely perfectly fine. But can we honestly just talk about how cute this top is? So I've done it up the same way that the model had it done up before. I did have it in the bow, which I actually think did look quite cute. This is it in like 
a real rough bow or as I said the model actually had it like this let me know which way you guys prefer however I just absolutely love this top I can so imagine myself wearing this on holiday fun fact as you guys are watching this is um the day I was actually going on holiday to Thailand but we're not going <laughs> but there's always next year that obviously I can wear this on holiday not gonna lie when I first saw it I thought nah that's not really a bit of me but obviously we shall see how it comes but Again, thanks to Nicole, you got me something that I'm probably going to absolutely live and die in. In summer, because I'm really one of those people that when I find something that I love, I will wear it every single day. But let me know what you guys think of the top, because honestly, I am so obsessed. And then I ended up asking Casey what she thinks that I should wear. I actually love Casey so much, and when I actually messaged her, she really made me laugh. She was like... I'm going to be deciding whose outfit's best and worst because if you're going to pick who's best, I'm going to go your fashion sense. Which I thought was hilarious. She asked me if I had some mum jeans already because obviously lots of things are out of stock right now which I clearly do so I will be putting those on and they are PLT by the way so I feel like it's okay and then the top she chose me was this again this was actually her second choice of top the first one she picked was so cute so I'm really upset they didn't have that one but this is the next one that she chose if you guys know me I'm a very uh white top kind of gal so she definitely got that right and it's just is it actually no wait yeah you can actually undo it with the wait can you Oh, I don't want to do it, then I'll be able to get it back on. It's basically like a corset detail, and it's got little cap sleeves. Looks like you need some cleavage going on, so we may struggle with that. <laughs> and then she also picked me up this bag. I've honestly never had a mini bag. I don't know. Now, what can you, like, are these just for fashion? They must be. I literally couldn't even fit my phone in there. Where is my phone? Like... I don't really get them. It's a cute bag. It would definitely do for Instagram or something. And she did actually give me some shoes, but they didn't have my size in the shoes. So sorry, Casey, but your whole outfit pretty much got overturned. <laughs> and then this is obviously Casey's outfit on. Not gonna lie, I was a little bit unsure at the start. Even though this is very much my style, but obviously like the tiny little bag is not. However, I feel like the vibe she was going for is so nice. I'm going to leave a photo of the shoes that she wanted me to get, obviously, with this outfit on the screen now. So you guys can see what she was going for. And now I can imagine it all on. I actually think it'd be a really cute look. However, obviously, unfortunately, I couldn't get the shoes. However, the whole outfit all together, obviously, I've just got the same jeans on that I had on in the last clip. If you guys can hear some um, building works, I have absolutely no idea what my next door neighbour is, but we kind of have to push through so i do apologize for the noises they were probably about to hear but this is what it looks like obviously it has the corset detail here and you can kind of see a little bit of skin don't know if that's just because i'm stretching it a little bit um but i think it looks nice and i also really like the sleeves i'm just such a jeans and a white top kind of gal like it's pretty much all i ever seem to wear in white trainers so i like the pop of color it definitely adds something a little bit extra right are you meant to hold these like this I don't know. And then finally I asked Emily to pick my outfit and don't get me wrong before we get into this. I absolutely love Emily. I think she's the sweetest, most down to earth girl out there. However, Emily, if you are watching this, you know why I'm not impressed. So I'm going to start off with the top. The top I actually don't think is that bad. It's like a cropped butterfly sheer top. I'm obviously going to have to wear something underneath this, otherwise we're going to be in trouble. Um, but yeah, Doable, I think. Do you know what? This would actually be cute if you could dress it up properly, but no. Emily decided not. So for the skirt, also, if anyone owns these pieces of clothing, I don't mean to insult you. It's just really not my personal taste. Let me show you. What is this, Emily? I look like I'm dressing up as fancy dress to go to jail. I don't know what material this is. You guys can tell. Bright orange skirt with like a utility belt. And then to top it off, she did not hold back. This is the jacket she got for me. To go with this, and this. I don't think I was her favorite person when she was picking me these outfits. So this jacket, I don't know what kind of style jacket it is. It is like furry, it's like, is it wool? I don't even know. As I said, definitely not a fashion channel. We're just doing this for the fun. And it's lime green. So, I mean, we shall just see how this outfit looks. Love you, Emily, but not today. I would just like to say a big shout out to Emily for making me come onto camera looking like this. So, not gonna lie, 
like everything fits perfectly fine and I actually really like the top. I have just put it on though with like a Victoria's Secret sports bra. Probably should plan something a little better if you're going to wear this top. It is a little bit short though. I got it in a size 8. So if you did want to get this top, I think size up because if I lift up my arms... I mean it's actually not bad. I thought it might rise. It hasn't but uh, I don't know. Maybe for a bit of extra security. But yeah, I don't really think I need to go into too much detail about this. Like I can't even make it look that much better by even like draping like it's literally like i don't really have a lot to say i mean the jacket's really soft it's very cozy if this was black i'd be like real super cozy but in lime green it's not really my vibe and the skirt so um again not really my vibe not a bad fit though it does have a good fit to it but uh does that really even matter when everything is clashing <laughs> as you all know the worst part of this video is i now have to do my outro in this outfit because this is the last outfit that i've tried on but anyway so i'm gonna rate the outfits from four obviously being the worst and then number one being the best who do we think's last <laughs> this outfit from emily is obviously going to be last it's quite the outfit shall we say however the next three are very very close um oh gosh I don't know. I love them all. Like, I love certain aspects of them all. So, I'm going to go Amber, Casey, then Nicole. The thing I love about Amber's is the trousers. I'm probably going to live and die in those. The thing I love about Casey's is just the vibe of it. And finally, I'm just obsessed with that top that Nicole chose for me, which is why I think she might have just edged her bets a little bit. Like, it is such a cute top. And the other original top that she chose for me was so stunning as well. I'm going to leave it on screen. It was out of stock though, so as soon as that comes back in stock, you best bet I'll be on PLT and I am going to obviously get my hands on that. But anyway, I hope you all did enjoy this video. If you did, be sure to leave it a massive thumbs up, comment down below your thoughts and if you guys want YouTubers to pick anything else for me in a video, then let me know what that should be. And obviously if you guys aren't already, then make sure you subscribe to my channel, go follow me over on my Instagram and I shall see you all very soon with a new one. Bye!